Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, the bulk of the showers this morning occurring during the pre-dawn hours. Most of them are out of here around 6 o'clock this morning. Took a while, but the sun finally making a return as we check out live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. Not finding anything. Most of the showers have pushed to offshore. There's still a small chance of, a, of an isolated a shower or thunderstorm redeveloping this evening as we take a peek at the radar and you can see that uh, it is quiet for now. But later on this evening as an approaching cold front comes through we'll have to watch for the possibility of one or two popping up. Though at this point I think it's more the exception rather than the rule. Milder temperatures ahead just in time for the weekend. Perhaps you're thinking about the beach. Well there'll be some sunshine but when you jump in the water this time of year the water temperatures are only in the 50s. All right, check out the uh, time lapse. Actually, the live pictures from Providence right now with sunny skies and 62. The winds are out of the south, southeast at 14. Relative humidity now coming in at 78%. Temperatures range, and there's a wide variety. 59 Newport, 75 Willimantic, 70 at Smithfield, and upper 60s in New Bedford. Some spots with a sea breeze like Newport, it's a lot cooler. No sea breeze in Willimantic. Sunshine at 75 and looking good in Smithfield as well. Here's the situation. An approaching cold front, you can see a line of showers and thunderstorms just uh, outside of New York City and across Pennsylvania. Small chance that one or two may try to sneak in here later on this evening, though at this point it's more the exception rather than the rule, what I would call hit and miss. Most of us probably not even getting one. So heading out this evening and overnight, for the most part, the weather should not be a big problem, though there is the chance of a brief pop-up thunderstorm as temperatures drop through the 60s and then overnight tonight generally clear. Tomorrow morning, sun up at 526, looking at some sunshine. Temperatures up to about 65 by 11 o'clock in the morning and then during the afternoon I mean real nice breezy and dry and comfortable temperatures in the lower 70s by 2 o'clock here it is in more detail even along the coastline it'll be pretty warm and the reason why there's no sea breeze tomorrow there's more of a land breeze a west northwest wind and that usually keeps the coastline a lot milder than had the wind come in off the water so places like Newport very comfortable lower 70s inland from Boroughville to Situate to Cumberland with plenty of sunshine looks real nice across the Cape, the islands, New Bedford at 70, Taunton at 73, and Fall River coming in at 70. Bay forecast calls for a west-northwest breeze at 15 to 20, a little gusty in the afternoon, waves of 1 to 2 feet, and the visibility should be unlimited. Seven-day future cast showing the great weekend ahead. Sunshine on Sunday, 73, even warmer with more sun on Monday, a high of 75. We bring back wet and cool weather for Tuesday and Wednesday of next week with temperatures in the mid-60s. But the green light on all outdoor activities for this weekend, WPRI.com to get your seven-day future cast. So looking good next three days. Uh, no complaints. Okay. Thank we'll you, try not to. <laughs> <laughs> Coming up next, then I will